In this video, I will share with you the absolute best super trend CCI trading strategy for scalping that will instantly make you a profitable trader. This strategy is so simple that it can literally be used even by beginners. It works crazy well in a 5 minute time frame and to prove that, I will also backtest it 100 times on the price of natural gas, so make sure you watch the video all the way through so that you don't miss any important takeaways. Okay, without wasting any time, let's jump straight into it. Alright, so we have our chart open. By the way, this strategy can be used on higher time frames as well. You can try it on 15 minutes or even a 4 hour chart. Alright, now let's go ahead and build our setup step by step. So first let's click on the indicator section and search for Supertrend Plus. Select this indicator by Electrified. Now let me briefly explain how the Supertrend indicator works. The Supertrend indicator relies on two fundamental dynamic values, period and multiplier. This indicator is plotted on either above or below the closing price to signal a buy or sell. If the Supertrend indicator moves below the closing price, the indicator turns green and it signals an entry point or point to buy. If a Supertrend closes above, then the indicator shows a sell signal in red. For our strategy, we're not going to be using the Supertrend in a standard way. We're going to be using it with the goal to find the levels of support and resistance. Notice when the price action is approaching the Supertrend, it usually bounces off of it. So the idea behind the strategy is to identify the trend direction first and then enter the market when the price action makes a pullback. This strategy is very effective in a trending market, however when the price action is moving sideways we might encounter losing trades. And this is why we need to add the CCI indicator to the chart in order to confirm the entries given by the super trend. So let's go ahead and search for commodity channel index and select this indicator right here. Now let's access its settings and make some adjustments in the star section. CCI is a momentum-based oscillator used to help determine when an investment vehicle is reaching a condition of being overbought or oversold. This technical indicator assesses price trend direction and strength, allowing traders to determine if they want to enter or exit the trade. The indicator can be used to provide trade signals when it acts in a certain way. The CCI is primarily used for spotting new trends, watching for overbought and oversold levels, and spotting weaknesses in trends when the indicator diverges with price. CCI will help us identify the times when the price action is overbought or oversold during ongoing trend. For example, when the price action is moving in an uptrend and then it makes a retraction or a pullback, such pullback is only confirmed when the CCI gets oversold. If the pullback is not confirmed by the CCI, then we should ignore such signals. Notice here the price action pulled back into super trend, but the CCI did not get overbought. So in this case, you would skip this signal and wait for a new pullback. On a second pullback, the CCI got overbought, which indicates a valid trade entry. Okay, now you know how these indicators work. Now let's understand the exact rules for entering long and short trades. So here are the rules for entering a long trade. First, the price action must be moving above the super trend. Second, the market needs to make a pullback. During this pullback, the candlestick must be touching the super trend line. However, it must not cross and close below the line. Third, the CCI indicator must get oversold. This means that the line is being below the 100 level. Fourth, the CCI blue line must break above the 100 level. And finally, we're going to enter a long trade as soon as we have a bullish candlestick that closes above the body of the most recent bearish candlestick. Our stop loss will be set slightly below the super trend line. And for this strategy, we're going to be targeting one and a half times the risk. If the candlesticks are not touching the super trend line during the pullback, such pullback automatically becomes invalid even if it's confirmed by the CCI. Let's take a look at one more long example. We see the market was moving above the super trend and then it created a pullback. The CCI confirms the pullback. As we can see the indicator got oversold. Then the CCI crossed above the minus 100 level. The price action is also closed above the most recent bearish candlestick.
Now let's understand the sell positions. So first, the price action is moving below the super trend. Second, we need to have a pullback where the candlestick touches yet not crosses and closes above the super trend line. Third, the pullback needs to be confirmed by the CCI indicator. The indicator should get into overbought area. Fourth, the CCI must break below the 100 level. And finally, a bearish candlestick must be closed below the most recent bullish candlestick. The stop loss will be set slightly above the super trend. The take profit target at one and a half times the risk. Okay, let me give you one more sell example and then we're going to start a backtesting. So here the price action is moving in a downtrend. We had a valid pullback. The CCI indicator confirmed it and then it gave us a signal to sell. Okay, I hope you have understood the rules for the strategy. Now let's find out its true win rate. Okay, the backtesting is finally finished. I set my initial account size at $100 and I was risking 2% per trade in order to make 3. The win rate for the strategy is 74% which is extremely high for a 5 minute time frame and we gained over 427% of profit on our account. I found those 100 trades within 5 months. The profit factor is 4.27 and we had 12 consecutive wins against 2 consecutive losses. I'm really happy with these results and I give the strategy a score of 9 out of 10. It's definitely worth backtesting on different markets and different timeframes. Even though these results are really promising, all the backtests are unique. Do not base your investment decision off of this advice. You should definitely demo trade with the strategy first before trading live. In case if you're wondering what backtesting app I'm using, it's called Trader Edge. This app is really useful and it's much faster than a traditional backtesting method. They got a 7 day free trial so feel free to sign up for my affiliate link. This way you'll also support the channel. By the way, if you want to see the highest win rate strategy on the channel, check out this video right here.